Hello everybody, I'm Palkifano8, and welcome back to more Tales of Eternia! Last time, I finished up stuff in Inferia. I got all the lenses, and I did a side quest that I really didn't think I was gonna do. So we are pretty much done with all the side quests now. So I went back here to Giselle's castle, and today, we are gonna fight Sakundas, the greater, no, the supreme Kramel of time. I'm just gonna say it right now though, I am a little bit underleveled, so I will probably die a lot. But that's actually very normal, because Secundus will pummel you. And if you're not prepared to fight him, Secundus will pummel you more, and will most likely destroy you. So this is the party that I'm going with. I have Max in here, but I'm not gonna control him myself, because that will actually make this battle way too easy, and I don't want that. So this is my equipment setup for Reed, and you might be thinking, Eternal Sword against Secundus, that can't be good since it's time elemental. Well, you see, Secundus is barely resistant to his own element, and the Eternal Sword is actually one of the few weapons that actually work against him. Almost all other weapons will only do one damage a hit. I don't really mind though, since that will make this battle a little bit more special, I guess I can say. <laughs> and I also have Klaus's bandana equipped. I don't know if it will, if it will help because of its uh, time resistance, but uh, I just like to equip it, just because I have uh, the Eternal Sword equipped. And Kiel got pretty much the same as before, except he got a Force Ring now. Reduces physical damage by 20%. It's pretty important. And then Meredy. She is also pretty much the same, except she got the Protectoring equipped, which will reduce physical damage by 10% because I ran out of Force Rings. <laughs> and then Max. Still got his Jet Boots equipped and Reed's Golden Helmet. And a Reflect Ring, which will reduce elemental attack damage by 20% since he is weak to magic. So that's it. Now, let's do this. Let's fight the strongest Kramul in the game. If you wish to fight me some other time, I, Secundus, will accept your challenge. Alrighty then. Secundus, fight, yes. Of course we'll fight. We're more than strong enough to challenge you. Oh, really? God, I respect your spirit. But my power is incomparable to that of other greater Kramels. Are you ready to challenge me? Oh god, this is gonna be fun. Secundus is pretty much the optional super boss of this game. He's the Pluto of, of this game, I guess I can say. You bet we are, Secundus. Let's go. Talk is cheap. Let's not waste any more time. Indeed. Okay, let's go. This music is awesome. Do this guy look a little bit familiar to you? Hmm? Well, Secundus is a direct reference to Daos. And you know me, I love me some Daos. <laughs> I freaking love this battle. And it also got my second favorite music in the whole game, which is once again a remake from Fantasia. It is amazing, but I digress. Secundus is resistant to all elements, except Vault Element, which is a nice touch since Daos got completely destroyed by indignation in the beginning of Fantasia. And uh, <laughs> let's just say, just you wait and see. And it's also pretty fitting that I got the Eternal Sword equipped, which, as I said before, is one of the few weapons that can actually damage him. So I guess they continue on with the uh, Daos can only be destroyed by magic thing from Fantasia, which I also really like. And if you got Max in your party, you just want him to use Aqua Spiral. Because now Max's boss destroyingness, I suppose, really is gonna shine through. And of course, take away his ability to actually attack normally. You just want him to use skills. Okay, let's go! I must warn you though, this battle can be pretty damn hard. And if he gets you into a corner... Oh god, like this, ow! Yeah, you might be finished. <laughs> Oh, thank you, God. Yeah, you see that? He killed Kiel and Meredy like there were nothing with his Secundus Corridor. Yeah. 
You see? Ow! Yeah. Sekuna's laser, he got all of Daos' attacks. He even got Tetra Assault. I don't think he got Tetra Spell though, but uh, maybe he got it on higher difficulties. I can't really remember. <laughs> but you will die a lot, so make sure you have enough items or else I don't think you'll be able to win this battle at all. Because Secundus, he will not let you go. He will hunt you down. And he just killed Meredith again. And he will kill you. And holy shit, that Aqua Spiral did a lot of damage. And that's why I love Max. Ow. God damn, that Secundus Corridor is powerful. <laughs> God, ow. You should always try to prioritize to revive your party members. But if you're as low HP as I was there, you should heal yourself first. Or else he will just... Secure this laser to the face and you're dead. <laughs> and Max is dead. Yeah. I told you people was gonna die a lot. <laughs> huh, I never really noticed that Quickie looks sad when Meredith goes down. <laughs> oh well. Come on. Ow. You can't even get away from Secundus when he uses... Secundus Corridor, that's not cool, dude. <laughs> ha! Missed me. Well, that did less damage. Why? Oh, thank you for that. Restore is such a good healing spell, though. Come on, shoot him. Oh, yeah, thank you, Max. Awesome. If you want this battle to go very swift and very easy, just control Max and run from side to side and just spam Octa Spiral, and Secundus will go down in. I don't know, two minutes maybe? It's insane. <laughs> Ow. Ouchie. But yeah, I just love that they actually have a Daos cameo in this game. Even the music. It's called Time Battle, by the way, so if you want to listen more to it. <laughs> and that they actually make him remotely challenging is just awesome, since he was actually the final boss of the first game. And he wasn't really easy in that game either. And I really like that they made him the Kramon of Time, since Daos could time travel, and he used it a lot. So, for all we know, this is actually Daos, only he, I don't know, changed his name and traveled to a different world. Maybe that's why Kles and Arche, or actually the whole gang is here to stop him, I don't know. Who knows, it's completely up to each individual really to find their own little reason for him to be here. <laughs> And that's why I like cameo battles so much, because they make me think like that, and and I just want to find a connection, you know, even though it's rarely a connection at all. <laughs> okay, he's getting close, nice. Okay, I can actually do this right now. <laughs> okay, when you damage Daos enough, actually a normal mode, if he's down to half health, try to cast indignation on him. Oh god, ow, ow. Ow, okay, he do not want me to do that. Ow. <laughs> God, that hurt. Ow. Damn you. Let me go. No, 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 no. Come on, get up, get up. Oh, thank you. God. Okay, heal, heal, heal. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, thank God. Yeah, if I died there, I would be pissed. Okay, come on. As I said before, this battle is just one big reference to the Daos battle in Fantasia. But the biggest reference is coming right now. Boom! <laughs> Epic! Yeah, you get that extension when you cast Indignation on Secundus when he is at half health. Where does all your strength come from? Mortals are truly interesting. Now, take this with you. Thank you. What is it? We get the Darius Emblem! Well, if you don't know, you need multiple Darius Emblems to get to Daos at the end of Fantasia. If you don't have a Darius Emblem equipped on your party member, they will be teleported to a dungeon in Daos' castle. So that's a nice reference there. We are grateful, Secundus. So we pretty much just defeated Daos again. Now, you might think that, oh, the Darius Emblem is just a trophy you get for defeating Secundus. Well, 
Yes, kinda, but... A proof of victory against the Kundes. Increase accuracy by 100. So, uh, hitting an enemy won't really be a big problem anymore. <laughs> but, it also got a, uh, let's say, a hidden use. You need the Darius Emblem to be able to use the final skill in what's called the Maxwell Extension. Now, I haven't talked about those before because I can't use them. You need to be on a second playthrough and fought one battle on hardcore mode. And then you can use the Maxwell Extensions, which is, of course, extensions on Maxwell Summon. And let me tell you one thing. Not many things can survive that extension. It is insanely powerful. I will probably show it off later, but as I said, I can't use it right now. Anyway, we defeated Secundus, the strongest Kramel in the game. So I think that's gonna be enough for today. Because I need to get to the gym and hurry back home to the Nintendo Direct. <laughs> I just hope Nintendo's gonna come with something that's gonna blow my mind. I kinda doubt it, but hey, a guy can dream, right? <laughs> but anyway, next time, we are gonna go back to those pillars and hopefully get some of those out of the way. Because we're coming for you, Giselle. Just you wait. So, Apalki 508, I thank you all for watching and I see you all later.